Welcome in sports fans. Tomorrow play gets going at the American Family Insurance Championship and we'll focus on those results but right now Ken Green is a part of that field. Green's story is much more important that w than what place he finishes in. You know you wake up in the hospital. I have no memory of what happened. You know and I wake up and I see my sister and I'm like you know, what, what, what's going on here? What happened was a horrific RV accident in 2009. Green lost his wife, brother, dog, and eventually had his leg amputated below the knee. My main goal from this point on was to play golf again and then go out and tell the story and, and talk to anybody who, you know, life throws nasty curveballs at you and it, you know, you can get through it and, and you've got to fight and you can't give up. But Ken's newfound outlook on life would be quickly tested. Five months later, my son dies and die. You never expect the child to, you know, to go before you. I had to make a decision. I, I'm either going to go in the bar and drink myself to death or I'm going to, I'm going to keep living the promise I made to myself, you know, prior to Hunter's uh, passing. Green kept to his promise, but could not impact lives as he envisioned due to debilitating pain in his leg. It was depressing that I, here I am, I felt like I had a great attitude and that I was going to uh, attack life and do the best with it that I could, and this leg was holding me back. After countless surgeries over the last seven years, the Connecticut native recently underwent a procedure that allowed him to move forward. The difference between my and me now and, you know, four months ago, you could ask my wife or any, anybody, is like, it's like the moon and the earth. It's just two different worlds. Now Green is standing by his credo to get all he can out of life. I made an absolute vow to myself that things that people stress themselves out over, whatever it is, isn't going to bother me at all. I'm not going to make everything I went through and throw it in the garbage and, and not pay attention and not learn from it. Because if you don't learn from it, then that's on you. Golf is not only a passion, but now acts as an outlet to reach other amputees and people who have endured horrific tragedy. I really want to get through people's heads that we've, they've got to mellow up. We've, we've got to enjoy the run that we're doing. What a story there from Ken Green. You have to admire his perseverance through such serious tragedy. We're excited to see him on the links at University Ridge tomorrow.